up guys? It's your girl Joy, back with another finger. <laughs> I am in the kids' bathroom and I'm going to attempt to repair, uh, or I'm going to attempt to put this, to hang this back up. At this point, I'm only gonna use one screw. This is like the little towel thing. And it was never really secure when we moved in. What I'm trying to do is the little things that I can do before you know. <laughs> Y'all think I'm playing? You think I'm playing? And I'm not doing this after this next lease is up. I'm out of here. Instead of paying $60,000, I'll be putting that in a bank and I'll be saving $60,000. That's in my head. <laughs> Okay, let me show you how I am going to attempt to hang this back up securely. I'm only gonna do one with a toggle bolt. A toggle bolt looks like this. And it must go into the wall, into drywall. It needs to be empty on the back, nothing behind the drywall. Then so you put this in there and you do some stuff and hopefully it'll be secure. So let's see how I'm going to work this. Come along with me. So this is where it was. The tile rack was right here and it, it's just been down ever since. And I'm hoping that these holes will be big enough. Yep, these holes are already here. You can also make a hole with this. You don't even need a tool. So let me show you how I'm gonna do this. So ladies, I am seeing this with love that there are some things that you could do if you don't have a man around and you want to hang something behind some drywall, hollow drywall, and you want to hang something heavy. Um, let me see how much weight this could hold. Hold on. It says that this can hold up to 70 pounds in drywall and holds up to 185 pounds in a block, but we're not doing that. So I guess if you have a block, you drill, you have to drill a 3 16th inch hole through it and then you feed this and it'll hold that. That's a lot of weight. Um, but this in drywall is 70 pounds. Nobody should be dangling from this anyway. It should be able to hold a towel, okay? So let me show you how to do this. Like so. Let me do the top one. Make sure it goes all the way through. So it's all the way through. Hopefully it dropped down. Okay, so now I pulled it, I put it in and then when I pull it back, that metal piece will stand up and it'll grab the back of the wall. So now I'm gonna push this piece in. I'll use this. To push there's a plastic piece. Let me show you. Push. Push this into the wall. So I'm pulling this back so I can get some tension, but I need this plastic piece to go into the wall securely. And I'm gonna break them apart like so. They just snap off. And this is the screw that came with it. So I'm going to use this. Put the screw in here. And it's like it fits just right. I even have to screw this in here. This is the screw. Yeah, here we go. Put it through that hole. And I'm going to start to screw and it gets tighter and tighter. <sighs> Secure.
And that's how you use a strap toggle, okay? And also with these, so that's going nowhere. The only thing that it is scary putting in that big hole. So you'll need a drill bit that's 3 16th of an inch. But you can also use this, this part right here, and twist it into the wall. You don't have to even use need a drill for this. So, baby, let me tell you, when you can do stuff on your own, you can. Okay, ladies? Was that not easy? That was easy. Was not the hole was already there. It seemed like it kept getting bigger every little thing they tried. What they tried initially was what they tried initially were these little things. And this one never even opened because that's why these two sides aren't up. So this one never really worked. And so this, this is the, this not going anywhere. And I could put two, but it's fine with that one. Okay? Okay. So. If you have any comments, leave them down below. And once again, these are the strap toggle bolts. And I've used these to hang heavy mirrors and stuff like that. But you do have to get over your fear of seeing that big A-hole. <laughs> Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe if you are a newbie here and you hit the post notification so you know the next time I upload a video. What? And you know I'm not always regular, but you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean. So if you have anything that you want to hang, baby, don't be afraid of those big holes. Okay? Because I tell you so. You know what? You better Google me, boo. Look at that. Kids, towel rack back. Towel rack back. Back. Back like a heart attack, all right? Back. Now, I'm not saying it wasn't sitting down here for well over a year, maybe two, but you know, when I get around to it, I get around to it. This is when you don't have no man and got a honey-do list to do it for you. So what it is, when you a single mom of three kids, I get to the list when I get to the list. And today was a good day for a good day, all right? Now, just gotta make sure they clean these hand towels every so often and switch them out. <laughs> but you know, this is not my bathroom. <laughs>